Okay, well, while I was pushing this little wall back, I did find some interesting pieces. I don't know if you can see them. It's a pretty good, neat formation to them. Uh, we'll see how well they clean up, don't know. But something that's also very interesting is I found a hole. And this hole goes back up in there quite a ways. So we'll see what's all in it. We'll see together. Lots and lots of spider webs and old roots. Now still, it's extremely difficult to stand up, but we'll get it. I don't see any good crystals as I look up in there. Microcline, kind of chunky microcline. It's all always a good indicator. Some old ones, they're very rust encased and crusted. I guess that in itself is actually some material, so a little bit of hope. It's hopefully it gets into something there. It could be a nice piece. I don't know how well you guys are able to see any of that, but we'll see later. Stuff just falling down from the top. Uh, Real druzy almost microcline. Kind of a druzy crust to it. Good thing this isn't a country that has lots of poisonous snakes and whatnot. Just chunky microcline. Goes back a long ways. <laughs> Man, them spider webs are cool. Set that one over here for cleanup. <laughs> a blade, not a true crystal, but more like a blade. It's just like sticking your hand in rotten cardboard almost. This stuff is nothing but spider webby chunk growth and that I, I was just getting my set I didn't think of spider web so I found a bug in there <clears throat> could be just old uh, root growth well 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 there's another one cool Pretty good point. Pretty good. A lot of handfuls of bits and pieces of crystals. Sitting up on top of that rock probably. Yeah. Big spider. Some shiny microcline. Yeah. Yeah, that hole goes back in there a ways. <laughs> oh. 
Eh, I'll have to search this dirt, kind of uh, go through it a lot, but looks like there's lots of small pieces of crystals. Oh wow, look at that. That's kind of neat. That is kind of neat. Okay, uh, now's a good time to tell you. Uh, someone asked me the other day, what's a double, double termination on a crystal. What's the difference between a twin crystal and a double termination? This is kind of a twin. It's actually growed into another one, so that's a twin crystal. Double terminated would be, see this point right here? Well this crystal here is terminated. If this was also on the end over here, it would be a double termination, so it would be a double terminated. Just because you have two crystals together, that's not that's nothing to do with the double uh, termination part of it. That's at the end where it's got a natural end to the crystal. If it had two natural ends, that'd be a double termination. This is just kind of a twin crystal. Actually, a triplet. That's actually kind of neat. <laughs> Great hole so far. Let's see what else we got in here. Ah, there's something else coming out right here. Let's see if we can see it. Big. Very big. Nice, very nice. Cool. Just a block. But it's very see through, at least on one end. It's kind of neat. I felt that in there and I thought it was going to be a lot better. <coughs> Sorry. I thought it was going to be on all sides. But it's really not. Here's what's underneath that root. Wow. Not as bad as I heard, not as good as I thought it was going to be. Very good formed, nice and long, but uh, won't clean up much better than that. There'll be very little of that kind of stuff on it right there. These things just have a some sort of a rust growth on them that they're great, but they're, but they're in, inside they look like that. They're not real good and see through. Still, pretty cool. Working them old spider webs, kind of different. Okay. Looks like this side here is kind of grayish material, and this side here is that reddish material. And here's where the, the crystals are at, is in this reddish material. With as much iron as in is what's in this dirt, man, there could just be anything. It wouldn't surprise me to see different types of combos come out of here.